Hey guys, this is the look I'm going to be doing for you today. It's a Kim Kardashian inspired look. I just found a picture of her online and I really, really love the makeup she was wearing. She has really dramatic long eyelashes and a pink lip and a bronzy face. Um, the bronze isn't picking up very well on the camera, but in person it's very bronzy. And um, I hope that you enjoy this video and um, keep watching to see how I did it. Hey guys, so I just went in with my um, primer and concealer and concealed on spots on my face that needed it. And now I'm just going to go in. Um, I'm not going to be using liquid foundation for this look just because I feel like it really doesn't need um, a lot of foundation. Um, it just needs to be really um, bronzy. So rather than focusing on um, covering the skin with foundation, I'm just going to focus on covering the skin with lots of uh, bronzy sheen. And I'm just going to go in and just cover up on places. You're going to want to go in with an angled brush and your bronzer and really get a lot of the product on there and start working it in right here. Work it all over your cheeks. On the forehead um, and pick up some of that bronzer and line it right down your nose just to angle up your nose and just start up at your eyebrow and just work it down like that just because I noticed that she really always has her nose very defined on her show and in the picture that I'm using today. And then you're going to want to go in with any sort of highlighter and today I'm going to be using this um, pencil by Makeup Forever. It's just a shiny shimmery white um, color. I'm just going to go down the bridge of my nose with that like that and I'm going to apply a little bit right on my forehead in a little X like that then a tiny bit on my chin. And then I'm going to just go back in with a brush like this, just a fluffy brush. I'm just going to blend it in. And then I'm going to go in with this highlighter color. And I really love this one from this Maybelline palette right here. And just go on your cheeks and just highlight your cheeks. Back down that bridge of your nose, chin, and then forehead again. And just really make sure you blend that in really well. And it just adds a beautiful highlight um, to your face. You can go back in with some more bronzer on any places that you feel may need it. And that is the face. And, um, she really has just a light, um, rosy, um, um, blush on. So I'm going to be using this 
uh, pinky blush right here and I'm gonna go in with this brush and I'm just gonna pick some of that up just pounce it in there and smile and just apply that right on your cheeks and this is shimmery itself so it does add a really nice little highlight color to the skin as well. Okay. And now Kim has very, very, very defined um, eye brows. So I'm gonna go in just with a thin, small angle brush like this into my Coastal Sense 88 palette. And I'm gonna go in with this dark brown color right here. Pick it up. And starting right on the inside, I'm just gonna pack the color on. And her eyebrows are very even all across. So just make sure you pull a lot of that color on. And her eyebrows curve down very nicely, like far down, like here. Okay, so my eyebrows look really intense right now so because I don't have any makeup on, but um, for her eyes, she just has a really light blue color. So I'm going to just put on my primer, or my eyeshadow base, I mean. And go all the way up to that brow bone and now take a jumbo pencil like this and apply that all over your eyelid and then using your ring finger go in and blend it out Okay, and now going back into this palette, you're going to want to take a really, really light um, color like this. This blue one right here is perfect. And really just pack it on there well. And then pat it onto your eye. And then pull the color down and in and over like that. Okay, now take a light brown color. Um, I'm gonna be using satin taupe today, like this. Just a really light shimmery brown, and go in on a fluffy brush and just barely dab the color in like this and take it right above your crease right here and just work that color in and deepen it up on the outside just a little okay and now I'll go back in with any highlighter color. Today I'm going to be using Vex by MAC and just brush off, use the same brush but just make sure it's really clean and just go in with the highlighter color and you're going to want a kind of a little bit of a shimmerier uh, highlighter and just go right through that brow bone with that highlighter color and blend out that satin taupe just a little. And now, just go in with a, um, go in with any liquid eyeliner like this, 
and you don't want too much of a wing, but just get it really a nice thin line and go right to here. Just do a little tiny flick. Okay. Now she has really, really dramatic eyelashes on. Just a thin strip. Um, if there's any white, um, that you can see, like, see, I have some, don't worry about it. That'll just dry clear. Um, but if you do want to, you can just go over it with some black eyeliner again. Now, do the other one. Okay, now, once you've got those applied, um, make sure you go in with a eyelash curler and just curl them all up and then um, taking that jumbo pencil once again go through your waterline and just blend it right here in the corners and she looks like she has a little bit of a smudged brown underneath so take um, just a pencil brush and the satin taupe again and just smudge just a little bit of brown here underneath And just add any highlighter that you feel you um, And the last thing that's super important for this look is the lips. And she looks like she's wearing just a super soft pink, which is perfect for the um, Viva Glam Gaga lipstick. So just go in with a nice layering of this. And just a pink lip over. And that's it. Just a bronzed up um, blue eye with a little bit of darkness through the crease. Um, it's a beautiful look. It's fun for going out. Um, and I guess that this is it. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.